Kevin Sullivan over at Global Force Wrestling fires back at Sports Illustrated on Twitter. This is BQ when I do this for the Global Force Wrestling fan. Well, how about instead of focusing on those yahoos, you focus yourself on Eli Drake? What in the hell is going on? Boy, it's been a crazy last couple days in the Global Force Wrestling world. We don't know what the hell is going on. I can say this much with every passing hour, every time I might see a tweet or some other rumors. I have a little bit more calm and I feel a little bit better but it's still scary times for us fans of the company because we don't know exactly what is going on and hopefully we're gonna get some answers soon in Johnny impacts conference call they straight up said before the call they were not a answering any questions about the status of the company or Jeff Jarrett's situation they said to respect his privacy but they have continued to promote bound for glory they have released a press release about digital partners and digital media and new things on the horizon. Not only did we have that press conference or that conference call, I should say, next week the conference call is going to feature John Gaburik, Sanjay Dutt, and Scott Moore. So looking forward to that. Hopefully we can get some more answers. However, they say that conference call is supposed to be based around creative. With this being said, some people have stepped forward from the company to make the statement, don't believe everything you read on the internet. Kevin Sullivan, you may know him from the phenomenal work he has done with the old Global Force Wrestling and the current one, putting together tremendous, beautiful video packages and interviews, and the guy is a genius. This morning, Kevin Sullivan tweets at Sports Illustrated and says, at SI Now, when did it become okay to print BS? As a journalism major, I find your fact checking to be less than diligent. Will you be following up with another story with the facts? At Global Force Wrestling is launching the Global Wrestling Network. Tweets again at SI Now. Uncertain future. Anthem is committed to broadening Global Force Wrestling's footprint as we work alongside international broadcast partners digital platforms, and professional wrestling promotions to bring our passionate fans a high-quality product. That not only stands out in today's media landscape, but continues to thrive into the future. So Kevin Sullivan is basically quoting the press release that came out yesterday regarding the digital partners and the expansion of the company. What the hell is going on, I ask again. What are you guys making of all this? And here's my thing with all of this, and this is something that's always bugged me when it comes to Dirt Sheets and the Global Force Wrestling Impact Company, is that they are very quick to let us know when, hey, here's the rumors, here's the negative shit, but they never follow it up with the truth when the truth ends up coming out. And I'm not saying some of this stuff isn't true, some of the negativity, but what I am saying is when some of those negative things come out and then there's a positive resolution... You don't see that on the dirt sheets. And maybe they say, okay, well, that's not, we, you know, they, we don't focus on the positive. We focus, focus on the negatives. We create clickbait. That's what we do. But we know for some other companies, they would gladly clear up the situation. When it comes to this company, they make their money off the negativity. We all know this. And they never do a follow-up. So now we hear, here we are as fans, scrambling for the truth, scrambling to know what's going on. I will leave you with this. There's always two sides of every story. And there's only a few things in life that are certain. Death, taxes, Jason Solomon, being a virgin, and two sides of every story. With that being said, there's always something in the middle that is the truth. It doesn't matter if it's the Rosemary and Sexy Star situation. It doesn't matter if it's the Anthem and Broken Hardy situation. There's always something in the middle. Subscribe to the channel. This is BQ.